and welcome back to my book nook. So I might have some difficulty pronouncing this author's name. I'm going to apologize in advance if I mispronounce it. But today we're going to be talking about The Chosen and the Beautiful by Ning Vo. So this is a retelling of The Great Gatsby from the viewpoint of Jordan Baker. This Jordan Baker is an adopted Vietnamese girl into the Jordan family. So just a little bit of changing up race slightly. But it's really basically almost a point for point retelling of The Great Gatsby. The biggest change is, is hey, we're going to kind of queer the characters up a little bit. We're going to be much more explicit in Nick being bisexual and a lot more, hey, there was something possibly going on between Gatsby and Nick. But all in all, it doesn't really do anything. There was this whole underlying thing that would have been really cool if there'd been more with this, with this whole concept of paper magic, and I would have loved more of that being there. But it was just kind of like a, oh, every now and then we're just going to sprinkle in a little bit of this. And I think if there had been a lot more detail into that, or if it hadn't basically been almost a straight retelling of The Great Gatsby, I would have liked this book a lot better. This is going to get donated. I don't care to reread it. I've read The Great Gatsby. I've read this. I don't think reading this really did much of anything for making any changes to anything. I don't even think, honestly, making Jordan being an adopted, an adoptee from Vietnam changed anything really other than, hey, this is my, this is her connection to the paper magic thing that wasn't really talked about. I'm giving it a three out of five, a three out of time. It was well written, yes, but it almost felt like a waste of time reading it because there wasn't anything to be this is not a book you'd write home about. So, like the video, leave a comment if you desire, subscribe and ring the bell so you don't miss when I put up other reviews, and I'll see you next time. Bye!